What's up, YouTube? It's the Big Kahuna back again with another video. Congratulations to the PlayStation Nation for getting the news that you will be receiving Rise of the Tomb Raider. So, but for all the hypocritical fans, they heard the news. It was like this. Now, these fanboys are the same ones that when they found out or when they thought that Tomb Raider was going to be exclusive to the X1 platform was like, I don't care. Who cares? The game looks like crap. And in some cases, they actually said Tomb Raider is nothing but a copy of Uncharted. Are you freaking serious? I had a PlayStation 1. I didn't have a PlayStation 2. But I did have a PlayStation 1. And I played Tomb Raider on it. And I don't remember Uncharted at all. Now, I could be wrong. But I seriously doubt it. So, if anybody can find Uncharted for the PS1, then I will gladly come out and make a video and say I was wrong. But I know I'm not. But anyway, moving on. This news is good news for some people and good news or bad news for other people. The good news is the real gamers, the Sony PlayStation fans, not the fanboys, get to get their hands on the game. The bad news is they have to wait a whole year which really sucks but at the end of the day like I said we're all gamers everybody should get to enjoy the game the, the so called the fanboys who was like they didn't care about the game in the beginning now they know that it's coming out for them they're gonna love it when it comes out they're gonna get it the same ones who said they didn't care the same ones who when Destiny came out was bragging, literally bragging about downloadable content for a whole year. The same ones who said, this is a reason to get a PlayStation 4 because we got downloadable content for a whole year that's not coming to the X1. And then when the guys on the X1 said, we can wait the year, you guys said, damage control. So guess what? Now that you have to wait a whole year for this full game, you guys are saying, we can wait. You see how that works? Now, granted, there's going to be people who really don't care about the game who's on the Sony side. As well on the X1 side. And that's to be expected. Not everybody is going to like the same types of games. But for those people who were sitting there bragging about this one year DLC over the X1... The ones that was beating their chest get a PlayStation 4 because we get the downloadable content. We're getting the better version. I do remember that day when that game came out. You guys were playing and enjoying it. And guess what? The X1 crowd was enjoying the game also. So what? They didn't get the downloadable content for a whole year. I rarely buy downloadable well, content friend, anyway. Which way to? Indiana. But once again, you guys are going to wait for a full game for one year. And now it's okay to wait for four years. <laughs> Funny how that happens. Yeah. And yes, I know there's you know, hypocrisy on both sides. I've said that many times. And yes, I've said this also many times. I only talk about those Sony fanboys because those are the ones the ones who come to my channel 
the ponies, those are the only ones that come to my channel and talk shit. Not the Nintendo dudes, not the PC dudes, but the Sony fanboys. Shout out to my boy Zimblo, who I will be featuring, featuring on my channel so you can actually see what a true fan of the PlayStation looks like. Because a lot of you guys have to be confused on both sides. But as I always say, fanboys don't love their favorite system. They just hate jokes. And I'm back. You thought I was gone, but I'm back. I forgot one more thing. And I'm willing to make a prediction. When Uncharted... Not Uncharted, I'm sorry. When Rise of the Tomb Raider comes out for the XB1, there's going to be a lot of guys on this platform Twitch streaming. And they're going to be posting the links and, you know, on Twitter, Facebook, um, a whole bunch of different avenues that they're going to post their links. And I'm guaranteeing you, there's going to be a lot of Sony fanboys that show up in the Twitch stream. Because they're going to be curious to see what the game looks like and plays like. And no matter what the game looks like or plays like, they're going to say things such as 1080p, 720p, 23 million sold. You know, the usual fanboy shit that they say. And they're going to say, meh, and you know, stuff like that. And then they're going to say stuff as, well, when it comes to the PlayStation 4, it's going to be better. And you know what? With the year left to go, it should be better. But I'm guaranteeing this is going to happen. And yes, I know fanboys. I've watched many of Twitch streams and I've seen people from the X1 side who were fanboys who did the same thing on PlayStation's Twitch streams as well. But now I'm really done. And as I always say, fanboys don't love their favorite system. They just hate yours. Peace.